What is going on everyone? My name is Jason and these are the Treblab J1 Bluetooth earbuds. So you have a lot of heavy hitters in the Bluetooth wireless earbuds game today. You have your standard players like Sony and Bose, but you have companies like Jaybird who have really made a name for themselves with some really good offerings. And the space just gets more and more competitive as the demand for Bluetooth earbuds is becoming more appealing to the average consumer. The companies just mentioned all make really great headphones, no doubt, but they are definitely on the pricier side of the wireless earbuds market. Now, if you're looking for a pair of budget earbuds, Treblab has been leading that charge for many years now. Now, if you've never heard of Treblab before, They've been in the audio game for a long time, but they've really established themselves as a budget brand, and they're known for making really good headphones for really good prices. Now, I'm a huge fan of Treblab. I've used their headphones in the past, and I've actually done a review on some of the stuff that they have, and they actually reached out, and they wanted to know if I'd be interested in testing out their newest offering in 2017. These are the Treblab J1 Bluetooth earbuds. So they sent me out a pair, and I've been testing them for about a week now, and seriously, the J1s have got to be one of the best budget Bluetooth earbuds available in 2017. And here's why. The packaging here is quite simple and compact. Open up the box and you have this traveler case in this pretty dope red and black color scheme. The case is nice. It has a hard cover, but soft to the touch. Also in the box, you have some paperwork and some stickers, as well as the micro USB cable to charge the earbuds. Open up the case and you have the earbuds themselves. And in the side pocket, you get a whole bunch of additional ear tips and ear fins, a great addition to help you find the perfect fit. Now first, in terms of design, the J1s are fantastic. The line of thinking seems to be the more minimal you can make the wireless earbuds Buds, the better. And the J1s do a great job of keeping things minimal. The drivers are tiny and don't awkwardly stick out of your ears, making for a sleek look when you have them on. They look great when you're working out, but equally as good if you're in the office setting or on the commute. The housing of the drivers are capped with a brushed metal and it feels really premium, but they're still super light. The tips are also magnetic, a great feature as you can clip the drivers together to avoid losing them when you take them off. The flat cable that connects the drivers together is the right length, in it that it doesn't get all tangled up in use and doesn't sway back and forth enough to disrupt the drivers from losing their seal. Also on the cable, you have your inline remote. This is where you plug in the micro USB to charge the earbuds. It also has buttons for volume up and down, as well as a multi-function button to answer calls or make calls. The buttons are nice and clicky and separated enough to make them distinguishable when controlling them on the move. The drivers themselves come with ear fins attached to help secure the fit. And I'm happy to say that I didn't have any problems putting these on and I had a great fit even when I was working on out pretty hard. Now, if you're having trouble getting a good fit, you could try out some of the other ear tips and ear fins Treb Labs includes in the package. They even have these memory foam ones, so they're definitely trying their best to ensure that everyone can use these without any problem with them fitting in the ears. The J1s come equipped with Bluetooth 4.1 and pairing is a cinch. First time you ever power these guys on, they go straight into pairing mode and they immediately populate on your Bluetooth enabled device. Select the J1s and you'll get a voice prompt telling you you're all good and you're paired up. You have around 30 feet where you can stay connected and with Bluetooth 4.1, you have minimal to no noticeable latency if you plan on using these to watch videos or movies. Now, during my testing, I was able to get around eight hours of playback after being fully charged, which is pretty impressive. They only take around two hours to fully charge, and because I use these mainly to work out, I can easily charge them up on Sunday and have them last through the whole week without any problems. Another great feature is that these are IPX6 water and sweat resistant, so you can go running outside in the rain with these on, and it shouldn't be a problem at all. So last and most importantly, let's talk about the sound quality. I'm usually more of an over the ear type of headphone guy as it allows for much bigger drivers and in turn better sound quality, but I was legit impressed by how great these sounded. First of all, the volume gets super loud, which is important as a lot of budget headphones max out a little too early. You could definitely damage your ears with these no problem. You got a good emphasis on the low end, so if you're a bass head, these got you covered, but there's a surprisingly good balance of mids and highs to balance everything out. Though I do listen to mostly bass heavy workout music with these on, the low end isn't obnoxious and they sound really good with other genres, and even podcasts sound really crisp and clear. Overall, Treblab was able to design a beautiful pair of Bluetooth earbuds that sound absolutely fantastic. And for $39.99, what you're getting is pretty incredible. They may not be the biggest name brand out there, but with products like this, Treblab is becoming more difficult to ignore and they're becoming a disruptor in this Bluetooth headphone market. That's about it for this review. Don't forget to leave me a thumbs up if you guys liked it. And let me know what you guys honestly think. Do you guys think the Treblab J1s can legitimately compete with, let's say, the Jaybird X Freedom line? Let me know in the comments down below. And of course, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, be sure to hit that subscribe button and to turn on notifications so you can stay up to date with all my other reviews. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.